Hi besties! Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. If you're new here, hello and welcome. And if you're returning, thank you so much for stopping back for a yet another Timu haul. That's what we're doing today. Uh, so I would go through the Timu spiel, but I feel like most of you probably already know about Timu. It's an online marketplace, kind of like Amazon, with a bunch of different vendors, and you can find all kinds of deals on there. I will leave an affiliate code down below. I will also leave a link if you're interested in becoming an affiliate or an influencer. I will leave that link down below. I will also link all of the items in this order down below. Unless, of course, it's sold out or discontinued. And in that case, I don't know if it'll be down there or not. But let's hope that doesn't happen today. Um, so, yeah, let's just get right into this. Um, and hope for the best. <laughs> no, I have a couple of things in here, I think. Are pretty nifty um first thing i want to say is that i in my past videos and i was using these eyeshadow sticks i actually used them today um i only use like two colors but i think it turned out like really 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 good so honestly for the price of these and the ease of the use i use the brush on the bottom too i highly recommend these um so yeah if you're thinking about getting these go get them with that being said, I said in my last video, hmm, I wonder if I bought one that was like a multiples of it and gosh by golly, didn't I? So these come from like the local warehouse per se, if you want to call it that. So this is like a whole set and I think this one is called like the something neutrals. Um, I can't remember exactly. I don't think it's on here. Let's see. I don't think so. But anyways, it was $8.88. Um, but yeah, it was like some, it was called like something essentials, but I can't remember. So, or neutrals, I think it was called. Maybe it was called essential, essential neutrals. I don't know. But it, either way, I'll link it down below. So I have a feeling I'm going to become obsessed with these and I'm probably going to buy like every single collection of these, uh, eyeshadow sticks because yeah, I have these three. I have some upstairs I used, so I'm going to swatch all of these. There's six. I mean, for $8.88 for six, I mean, they come really well packaged. Um, this seller, now, if you're in a different country and you can't find, if my links don't work, search for this company name on Timu. It's Luxa, Luxaza, Luxaza, L-U-X-A-Z-A -A color sticks. Um, try searching for that, uh, maybe in the search bar if you if my links don't work. But, so here are the shadow sticks. On the bottom of these shadow sticks, there are color numbers. So here's the colors of these ones. Um, I am not super into like blue and purple, but I did notice as I was looking at these, I'm like, you know what? This, this kind of reminds me of like two sets of coordinating colors, which is why I kind of like these things. So I feel like these three coordinate together and these three, three coordinate, but honestly, you can mix and match however you want. So I, let me just do a swatch of these. So this is color number 49. Boy, I feel like this video is going to be like super long now that I'm doing all of this. <laughs> this is color 118. It's like a white. I'm not even showing. I'll show you in like a minute here. Let me get them all on here. This one is kind of like a purpley color. There's just like a variety in here. There's a, a black. I think I already have the black in like a different set. Uh, this one is kind of like a mauve, really pretty mauve purple, which I love. And then, oh, there's this blue color, which I don't really use a whole lot of blue, but hey, you never know, right? But there's swatchers, so the swatches of all of them. Really pretty colors. And I will tell you that these last a long time. Like I tried to wash these off my hand the other night from like just showing you guys. And I was like, it took me like you need makeup cleaner to remove it. I'll just say that. Like, th this isn't just going to wear off. So the other thing I like about all of these is that the bottom is this brush. And let me just, I'm just going to, it does blend it out. I'm going to blend all of these. I hate to do it with this one brush, but, you know, for the sake of time, I'm just going to blend them all out at once. But that's what they look like blended out. So the first thing I would recommend if you happen to get these is get a primer, get an eyeshadow primer to put underneath. 
but they I noticed that I think it was this company or maybe I was just looking through the other eyeshadow sticks but um they have also like long long wear ones which are 24 hour shadows but I'm gonna tell you right now if you ask me these are long wear because uh, like I said I try to wash these off my hand and it did not happen. I had to like get soap and scrub and scrub and yeah. So highly recommend these. They are very, very good. So yeah. All right, let's move on. First thing I want to talk about is this. So these, I bought these hair clips. Uh, it was a pack of maybe like six, six flat clips. Um, I didn't even put a price on them and I'll tell you why, because they, every single one came broke. So I've already done a return for these. They asked me to send them back. Why? I don't know, but they did. So I, I did the label, which was a free label. So just so you know, if you return something, you have the option to print a label. It doesn't cost you anything. And then they refunded me like $3 and 20 cents, which... I feel like that was a little bit less than what I paid, but they still refunded me something. So yeah, they every single one of them came broke. Like, every single one. I was hoping that, like, <laughs> there was at least one out of here that did not break, but yeah. Every single stinking one of them came broken. So, yeah. Anywho, I didn't, I didn't even care about the price. I, I think they were like probably three something, but like I said, I did do a return on these. So just keep in mind, they have been like asking for products back. It used to be you did a return and uh, they would just refund your money and that was that. But it seems like now maybe people kind of are taking advantage of that. So what's happened is they're asking you to actually send the item back, but that's not such a big deal. I think you get like one free return and order. So... Yeah, but yeah, I, I was so upset that every single one of them was broke. I was like, please let at least like one or two of them be salvageable. But yeah, that didn't happen. Okay, next are these nails, <laughs> me and my nails. There's a couple nail sets in here. I'm not going to lie. Let me take these out of here because the package came crushed. This package is like completely jacked up, but that's what they look like. They're like a Aurora Borealis type of color or aurora color or something really really pretty and of course it comes with these glue tabs and yeah so really pretty 228 did i say 228 yeah 228 for these but yeah the package is like completely demolished but you know kind of is what it is i guess okay i couldn't wait to show you guys this i don't know how but i got this little bugger for 64 cents it's one of those portable ceiling machines and i was kind of messing with it upstairs like before i came down here so it came in this little plastic bag which i tried out so i'm gonna i'm gonna try it again let me i'm gonna cut the top off of this bag where i sealed it so i can show you guys how this works so it comes with this charger i th i thought this would be good for like lunch bags or I don't know any kind of little bag you have to seal now would it seal a huge bag probably not or paper or anything I don't know I don't think so but um I could the the the, <laughs> the directions were so tiny I couldn't even read them but I got the gist of how you do this so if I'm looking under here I don't know if this thing like heats up or what and I can actually see something like there's like plastic right there I think it heats up but there's also a little cutter in here. So as you're, you know, it seems like you can cut and seal, but there's an on button. You turn it on. This blue light over here comes on. I don't know if you're supposed to wait for it to heat up or not, but like here's the little bag it came in. And I feel like this is something that you kind of have to like practice with to get it right. <laughs> but it says to start on the left and swipe this direction. So I'm going to start over here and let, okay, let's see if I can do this. I'm just going to drag it, drag this bag through if I can. Oh yeah. I'm over there. Okay. Hold on. Cause I'm new at this. So I'm dragging the bag through and it's cutting it. And like I said, you kind of have to be a master at this, but it does seal it. It does seal the bag shut. So, yeah, I mean, it works. It definitely works. There's the seal. It takes a little bit of practice, though, but it definitely heats up. Like, I mean, obviously, it has to heat up. But I can see a little bit of plastic in there, so you got probably got to watch about putting it away or, you know, making sure no one touches it if you have, like, little kids around and stuff like that. But pretty cool, though. It does work. 
So I thought that would be cool to use on like um, bags of potato chips and stuff like that to like seal seal them up, you know. And then if they don't seal all the way completely, because I feel like this, I feel like you have to kind of use this a few times to like get the gist of it. But yeah. Okay, next up is this. I paid $14.79 for this set. And I'm going to just tell you right now, I'm not super crazy about it. Um, it is like a dupe for like the Sol de Janeiro stuff, but I was like, Ooh, it looks so pretty. It's so summery. It's got like watermelon kind of effect going on. Um, but yeah, it's packaged beautifully. Like you get this box, you open it up and there's like, there's a body, you know, cream, body, whatever, body, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. Body, yeah, body cream. That's what it actually says on there. Body cream. And then you get this spray now i don't know if sol de janeiro has like a red this says flying at heart <laughs> natural care fine perfume now on this side it says brazilian passion so i don't know i don't know but it smells okay it's it's a uh, floral but a little bit creamy but floral definitely and i'm not big on the floral stuff i'm just not but the body cream um it's got this like seal at the top well it's not really a seal but that's what the body cream looks like and i literally i was trying to smell this stuff and i couldn't i couldn't even find a scent so now that i have it like out let's put it on like there's no scent at all to that none at, none at all like rubbing it in my arm now maybe it's a great moisturizer but i mean there's absolutely no scent to this whatsoever there's a scent to the, the other thing but i mean it's okay would i wear it yes is it my favorite and would i buy it again absolutely not i would not buy that a second time no definitely not i like that yellow colored one whatever it's supposed to be that's supposed to be like caramel or whatever i love that one but that one Mm. but you know what the weird thing is too and i think i have a caramel one in here if you buy them from different sellers they smell different so i never know what i'm gonna get with those so yeah anyway moving on these earrings were a dollar 12 it's a set of three i bought several of these style as you will see in this bag but i thought these were adorable and i know there is a uh a fashion designer who makes earrings like this teardrop shape kind of earring and yeah you get three pairs and i bought several of this design or shape or whatever you want to call it i don't know why they spoke to me <laughs> but they did but yeah a dollar 12 for three pairs i thought they were really cute now i bought this hair pin for a dollar 43 and you guys if you know how to use this let me know i literally don't know but i'm going to try and figure it out it's just a plastic hair pin it says creation france like right there which i'm pretty sure the same from france but it's like a white kind of milky color and then there's i don't know there's like some kind of colors it's almost like a pearl like can you see that like pearl kind of color right there i don't know so i'm gonna figure out i would like to figure out how to use this and get a top knot out of it so i don't know we'll see but that was a dollar 43 okay here's more of these earrings this is four pairs for two dollars and eleven cents if i can hold it um, they're more like the teardrop shaped again. Um, so you get four pairs in this one. These are, I don't know what, I don't know why these spoke to me, but there's the gold one. Here's the silver one. It's like a, looks kind of like a teardrop. There's a matte black again. And then there's just like a regular gold like that. They're just like a teardrop. I thought they were really pretty. I don't know why the style spoke to me. It just did. <laughs> and I got several of them. Because that's what I do here. That's what I do. When I find something I like, I'm like, yeah, gotta buy every single one. Every single color. Every single thing. So, yeah. $2.11 for those four pairs. Again, with this style. These reminded me of the 80s, though. These were $0.98. Cents, same kind of teardrop style. Um, but how stinking adorable are these? How cute are those? They're like acrylic, like rainbow. I love them. I think they're adorable. They're like little commas. <laughs> I don't know what you would call them. 
I call them teardrops. So cute. 98 cents for a pair of earrings. Love it. I just thought they were cute. They reminded me of the 80s. Okay, then I got this hair clip. It was $3.59. Probably a lot for a hair clip, but it looks pretty decent, so it's kind of big, but it opens like this. It's real flat. It's got some teeth in it. It's like a tortoise shell, and then it's got, you know, some comb. So I thought that'd be cute to, like, if I pull my hair up on the top just to clip it up. I thought it was really cute. So that was $3.59 because I honestly, I do not have a whole lot of hair accessories. I really don't. So yeah. All right. Another pair of pair. Why do I call them pair of nails? A set of nails, I should say. These are really small. So I'm thinking maybe they probably should have been kids or I don't know. I mean, I have small hands, but these are like significantly small. I feel $2.28 for these. Look how tiny these nails are. I mean, they're cute as heck. But I feel like, mm, are these even going to fit my nails? They might. If they fit my nails, they will just cover them, which is fine because I type a lot. So, you know, no big deal there. $228 for those. No. Yes, $228. That must, I might have to play that number, $228, because that's come up like twice in this haul already. Okay, here's another set of these. So, you know, another set of the teardrop ear earrings. They were $1.34, matte black, silver, and gold. I might give these to my mom. I think she would like these a lot. So since I got so many, I'm going to share the wealth. Okay, here's another one of those clips. 340, no, yeah, 345 for this one. Same one as the tortoiseshell, only it's just a black with a comb. I mean, that could hold quite a bit of hair. But if you want to put your hair up, you know, I just, I don't have a whole lot of hair clips. So I'm like, I'm going to get some hair clips. This must have been a hair clip haul for sure. Okay. I got these nails and they were $2.96. I'm not crazy about these. Tell me if I'm being tell me if I'm being just too judgmental. But they're they were called candy something or another. Candy, I don't know. The color was called like candy something nails, but I don't I'm just not crazy. Oops. Sorry. Here they are. I'm just not crazy about the color of these. I like that they're cat eye, but that yellow. It's like yellow, blue, and pink, but the yellow is almost like a lime green, almost, and it's just not my fave. Mm, am I going to wear them? Yeah. Am I going to want to? No, but $2.96 for these. I just don't like the color. I guess, I think on the ad, they I, I saw more of the blue and pink, and the yellow was more yellow, but like, on here, it just doesn't, I don't know, it looks almost lime green. I don't know. I mean, they're not horrible, but, you know. Okay, I have two sets of these, I think. I'm not sure where the other one is, so we'll have to look for it. But I saw these, and I was like, oh my gosh. You know, as soon as Timu starts bringing out Christmas and fall and stuff, I'm like, yes. I don't know why. Like, I don't wish summer away, Jen. So these were $5.93, <clears throat> which is high for me on the nail side. It comes with the little tabs. Comes with the nail file. These are so stinking cute, though. Let me take the... I gotta take them out of the package so you can see them. In all of their glory. In all of their wonderful glory. They're like a silvery blue, I would say. But they have Christmas trees on them. Christmas trees. And then the rest of the nails, um, there's one... Okay, so this nail, like, this nail, like, right here, kind of looks like Rudolph, in a way. If you can see it. Very light on the painting. Like, there's a little Christmas tree there. Um, there's, like, a couple of snowflakes. But, yeah, I, I just really like them. They're actually, like, a silvery, silvery color. But how stinking adorable are the Christmas trees? Love! So, I'm going to save those for the holidays. I got two pairs of those. The other pair is in here somewhere. I, I I must have accidentally ordered two. I've been doing a lot of that lately. That or I'm just not paying attention to what's in my cart. It happens. It happens to the best of us. So, yeah. Okay, so here's the one I was... Here's the perfume I was talking about that I liked. But I got this one for $6.29. But I sprayed it upstairs when I was, like, looking at this stuff just to kind of price it. And it doesn't smell at all like the other one. It doesn't smell like the other bottle of this that I got. There's no caramely to it. There's no... I 
I don't even know. I don't even know what scent I would call this, but that's the bad thing about these is like, I just don't know. Like if I buy it again, is it going to smell the same? I don't freaking know. I wish I knew. So I don't know. I'm a little, a little disgusted with that, but not super disgusted. So here's more, more of these teardrop earrings. Are we getting sick of seeing these yet? 347. I'll spare you the detail of, uh, actually, these are a lot bigger than the other ones. Look how big that one is. Let's see. So these come in gold, silver, and then there's this matte pink, which I absolutely love. So yeah, these are a little bit on the bigger side. So you get three pairs of earrings for, what did I say, 347. You get all the backs and all of that good stuff. So yeah, I really like these. I don't know why. They're just, I don't know. They're just, who knows? I don't know. So of course I bought them in every color and then some, but these are like a little bit bigger than the other ones, but they're still cute. Okay, here's another hairpin, which I'm going to have to figure out how to use. I'm hoping I can figure out how to use these to kind of hold like a top knot on top of my head. So we'll see. Wish me luck. You know, wish me luck and all of that. But yeah, it's just a really pretty tortoise shell one. Super pretty. I really like it. So I'm thinking if I put it in and like, whew, I don't even know. I have no idea. No idea how to use these at all. I'm going to have to get on YouTube and watch a video. <laughs> Isn't that, yeah, I, I literally watch YouTube for everything, like, how to do whatever. I'm like, oh, yeah, how do you get rid of wasps? How to whatever. I'm always on YouTube looking. For the answers to my questions are always on YouTube. Okay, then I got these really cute little hair pins, I guess you could call them. They were $1.79. You get two of them. I thought they were stinking adorable. These would be so cute in a little girl's hair, but I don't have a little girl, but, you know, I'm going to wear them anyway gonna wear them anyways you get two of them and they look like this it's just a wee tiny little gold bow I mean how cute is that so yeah you get two of them for a dollar 79 I think they had these in silver but they were sold out of the silver so I was like well you know I'll just get the gold ones they're just as cute so yeah I thought they were adorable so two for a dollar 79 here's another one of these I'll spare you going over I must have bought two of these Dollar forty-eight a piece. They are the little hairpins. Okay, let's see what else we got in this bag here. We got a box. Let's see what's in there, and then here's that other set of nails. I think that's it. Okay, so this is just the other set of the um, Christmas nails. I did buy two of them. Again, they were five ninety. Well, this is five ninety-three, but I swear I said five ninety-eight before. But what's a few cents between friends? You know how prices are, though? They fluctuate, so if you log in, it could be a whole other price. Whole other price. Who knows? Okay, last but certainly not least, I was super worried if this was going to come in one piece. Still not sure, but we're going to take it out and give it a little gander. Um, because my clips were broken, this was ten eighty six, and I was, yeah, so I was worried because those clips broke, and the box came, and there's like you know, holes all through the box, and then luckily it's covered with this styrofoam stuff, luckily. So here's to hoping it's not cracked. We're going to pull it out of here. If we can, if it'll come out. Okay. Please be in one piece. Ah, it is a beautiful ceramic mug, and I was so hoping this came in one piece. And then you get the lid for your coffee and there's actually a sleeve with it as well so how pretty is this a little pottery ceramic coffee cup i absolutely love this and then you get the little sleeve with it shut the front door you put the sleeve on here i'm not gonna do it right now because it just it my nails are like not letting me do much of anything but you know you just slide it right on there and then you get the little top like so that goes on and then you're set you're ready to go with your coffee for the morning how cute is this like I absolutely love the colors it's just so pretty but yeah it's like all the way down on the inside too like it's just so pretty I love it absolutely love it and they had in all different colors really really pretty for 10 bucks I mean I love pottery and ceramics so I just thought you know Maybe come, you know, winter time out on a sleigh ride, got your little hot cocoa or your hot tea in there. Yeah, I thought that was like super cute. So that was everything in this haul, I hope, I think. 
<laughs> I think I opened it all. Thank you guys so much for sticking around and watching. If you like this kind of content, please click like, please consider subscribing. Thank you again so much for watching and for coming back and leaving such great comments. I appreciate every single one of you so very much. Until next time, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.